Hey guys, welcome to today's video where we want to show you the exact new feature that we just implemented and put live. It is regarding a new update about templates where you're now able to also copy over all the e-commerce related settings like products and types and stuff like that, right? So as you can see here, we have a um, basically an e-commerce setting where we have some products four pages to be exact, as you can see here. So we have a few available here. I'm going to create a template and let's go to my bot templates and I will just do a new template for now. Select my chatbot template, go with a subflow template, just select all my flows for now because they will contain e-commerce related sections. Also going with keywords, and let's also do the default menu. Now, if we go towards the next step, you will see that we can now include product sample data, meaning that we can now also import the products inside the e-commerce store up to 50 products as sample data. This means that you will be able to basically grab all the available products and the related types and tags. So make sure that you check mark this uh, to enable this product sample data. If we go towards the next step, we can give the template a name. So let's just make this a T shop template. And let's leave the rest as is and create the subflow template. From here, going to grab this link, there we go. And now we are going to log into another workspace, right? So let me go into an empty workspace, create a chatbot real quick, to install the template on. And then from this chatbot, we can then install the e-commerce related T-Shop template on. And as you will see, you will then see that we also have all the e-commerce sections imported where we previously just had a blank, a basically a blank e-commerce shop. So let me just paste this in. There we go. And let me install this. Step, select the chatbot. Let's go and install now. And this will take a couple of seconds. Open the chatbot. And if we go towards the workspace right now and go towards e-commerce, you will now see that we have all of our products and all of our types as well. And as you can see, all four product pages have been imported. Any types will also be imported. If we have any vendors, they will show up as well. For the tags, you will see that we have the tags imported as well. And if we take a look at the other sections, discounts, for example, are not supported at the moment, as well as collections, if you had any collections available. So for now, you will have the products, you will have the types, the vendors, and the tags available to you. And if we take a look at the e-commerce setting now, you will also see that if we press the edit on the product gallery, that you will now have this exact same option where you can choose the product types based on the available data, right? So you will now also be able, if you want to basically filter by product tag, you will have all your tags available as well. So all of your entire e-commerce based template setup will remain intact and you can use them directly uh, as you designed it, instead of needing to redo every single e-commerce setting and like the product galleries and the filtering. Everything is now being imported with the template itself. So we hope you like this new feature towards the template installation where you can now also import the entire e-commerce shop, the native shop of UChat as well. So if you have any questions, do let us know and we'll try to help you out as soon as possible. And for now, have a great day, take care and a fun building.